Okay, to start things off, I just created a new project with a single slide that demonstrates where having a progress bar might be useful. Now, to begin setting up our progress bar, go to the Insert tab, click on Shapes, and select the rectangle. Then let's draw a rectangle on our slide that will serve as the outline for our progress bar. In the Format tab for our shape, change the shape fill to None. Change the color of the shape outline to black. And let's also increase the weight of our outline to 6 points. Now with our shape selected, press Ctrl D to duplicate it. Change the shape fill color of our duplicated rectangle to a color of your choice. Click on the Shape Outline drop down button and select No Outline. Now let's just drag our shape over our outline. Once it's positioned, right click it and select Send a Back. Alright, now that it looks like a progress bar, let's make it function like one. Select your inner rectangle and go up to the Animations tab. Click on the Add Animation button and select the Wipe Animation. We don't want the wipe going in that direction, instead we want it to function how progress bars usually do. So click on the Effect Options button and select From Left. If your timer only needs to last for 59 seconds or less, you can just change the value in the Duration text box. Unfortunately, you can't enter a value in here that's more than a minute. To work around this, click on the Animation Pane button. Now position your cursor at the end of the green bar until the cursor changes like so, and then click and drag it to the right. Keep holding until you get your desired time. Don't worry if you go over a little bit because you can always just drag it back to the left to readjust the duration. The last thing I'm going to do is click on the drop down arrow on our shape animation and select start after previous so that our progress bar starts as soon as the slide starts. Okay, everything's set up for our progress bar so let's start our presentation. And there you have it, we now have a working progress bar in PowerPoint.